Hi, this is Tammy from Michael's Consignment Shop on Madison Avenue in New York City, and we're here to talk a little bit more about how to spot a fake Gucci bag. So we talked about the monogram canvas and the monogram um, in the last video. Now we're gonna take a look inside the bag and look at some of the markings. If you look inside a Gucci, authentic Gucci bag, it's always gonna have a leather tab that has the Gucci label all in caps with that U that has a thicker side on the on the left side, centered perfectly on the on the leather tab. All Gucci bags at this point are made in Italy, so the leather tab's also gonna say made in Italy, centered underneath the Gucci, and it has the R um, with the trademark circle around it. On the back of the tab, there's gonna be two rows of numbers, so you're gonna to wanna to make sure that all that when you're looking at authentic, to authenticate a Gucci bag that it has two rows of numbers, um, and those numbers mean various different things. They're also gonna be perfectly imprinted into the leather. That's just all luxury goods. They take pride in their logo. They take pride in how their logo is presented on their bags. So while we're looking inside the bag, we can take a look at the lining. Now the thing about Gucci is that they have very different types of linings that they use, so it's hard to give you sort of a general sense. I will tell you that if it's monogram on the outside, it's not gonna be monogram on the inside. And that of course, because it is a luxury bag, they're going to fit well inside the bag. They're not gonna bunch, they're not gonna be look like they're pulling. The newer Gucci bags, and so this is not true for all bags, but the newer Gucci bags now have um, cards and things that come with them. They have what's called a Contralato card. And the Contralato car cards, you can see there's a couple different kinds um, that have been made. But basically, they typically have Gucci, and then it says Contralato, and then it has the numbers one through zero. It sort of tells you that it was inspected by Gucci and that it is authentic. They also come with some information um, cards and booklets, and sort of obvious, but if any there's any misspellings on, on these cards or booklets, you know it's a fake, because Gucci wouldn't do that. So make sure you just take a peek at these if, if they happen to be in the bags. If you are buying a secondhand bag, they may have been separated from their bags, so it doesn't mean that they're fake if they don't have them, but if you do have them, it's just another point to look at. If Gucci is ever put onto a piece of metal, it's gonna be engraved. It's not gonna be embossed, and it's not gonna be printed. It's gonna have, you know, you're gonna feel it underneath as being engraved into the metal. Gucci logo, there's been a couple different reiterations of it. Um, there's the Gucci um, that's all in caps that we've talked about with that U that's that's a little bit different. There's also on this bag here, um, Gucci, which is in cursive. So you may see that, but it's also um, engraved into the metal. You also will see the GGs sometimes. You're gonna have the right one over the left one, um, as it is on this. And of course the GG is for Gucci or Gucci, who is the founder of Gucci. So you're gonna wanna make sure, like I said, that if Gucci is written anywhere in the metal that it's engraved. And they do put it into a lot of different places. Like on this bag, it's even on the on the little grommets. Um, they've, they've put their logo. Not on every single piece of metal on a Gucci bag though, so don't get worried, because this one here doesn't have it on this piece of, of the bag. That's it for Gucci. Let us know what you think in the comments below, and if there's anything that you'd like us to review, let us know there too. And if you click here, I'll show you a little bit more about how to spot a fake.